Yesterday, we posted this video, EOS Block Producer Voting with Gray Mask Wallet, where we showed how to set up and vote for the block producers using the Gray Mask EOS Voter Wallet. This is a standalone desktop app that connects directly to the EOS blockchain. Now, today, we're going to be talking about how to get and create a named account on the EOS blockchain and also how to bid on premium names on the EOS blockchain. It's the voice of the blockchain here, Satoshi's biggest cousin, cryptography's finest, Champagne Crypto. Thanks for tuning in. Big shout out to all the crypto maniac boomers out there that continue kabooming the like and the subscribe button. Shout out to all the Steamosauruses, the EOS maniacs voting on there on the EOS blockchain, creating a blockchain governance like no other. Guys, make sure you're kabooming the subscribe, the like, and the post notification bell. Stay tuned in. Stay informed to the good crypto word that we spread here daily in the blockchain battlefields. Getting straight to it, guys. Today, we're talking about name accounts, how to create name accounts and bid on premium names on the EOS blockchain. I'll have this link down below. A toolkit by Jenner EOS. Io. This uh, Jenner EOS is a block producer candidate out there. And uh, let me tell you, after seeing this toolkit created by this block producer candidate, Jenner EOS, uh, I'm definitely, they've earned my vote. So I'm going to go back and uh, vote for them. I didn't include them in my votes yesterday, but a uh, shout out to them. They're creating some uh, kabooming tools out here. So let's talk about it, guys. How to create an account name. Okay. First of all, you need to pair your scatter here in order to uh, use this toolkit. Now, if you don't know what scatter is, scatter is a extension that allows you to log into EOS blockchain portals. Okay. You can get the scatter there at get hyphen scatter.com. Again, it's a Chrome extension or a Firefox add on. Uh, this way it manages your keys and allows you to log into the EOS different EOS sites. Okay, guys, so assuming that you've already paired your scatter, uh, and we'll be explaining how to create this account. Now, you'll see here that my scatter is not paired. I'm not using a uh, Chrome or Firefox browser for this video, but um, it's real simple. Assuming that it's already paired, your account name will appear here in this gray bar. Now, uh, most people uh, that already have an account have discovered that their account name is just a, a, a several letters. I think it's just a, a, a string of 12 letters. Okay. Uh, now people have been asking champagne, how do you create a legible, uh, a, a, an account that someone could read with a name? Uh, that's exactly what we're showing you here. The account name right now that you could create must be 12 characters. And that account name must be 12 characters using a through Z and one through five only. So you could see if you want an account, that's like, uh, let's say if you want to be, you know, uh, champagne, champagne won't work because that would be a premium name today. We'll also be talking about how to bid on the premium names, uh, later on on the video, but let's give you an example it has to be 12 characters. So you could do something like account name, uh, one, Account name one is 12 characters, and that falls into the parameters of A through Z and one through five. Okay, so in this case, you can you can get this account. You can create this account. Okay, and um, let's assume that we want to create this account, account name one. Okay, you need an owner and active key. You'll see that inside Scatter, there's a button that says generate new keys. Okay, press that button, and it generates a new pair of public and private keys. Okay, what you need to do is get your public key that you just generated and input it here as the owner key and input the same public key here on the active key. Okay, uh, net stake, CPU stake, uh, this is up to you. It depends on how much you want to stake into this new account that you're creating. Now, the last thing you can click on is yes, stake belongs to new account or unclick that no, stake belongs to the creator. Now, if you're familiar with the Steam blockchain, this is basically like delegating uh, Steam to another account. In this case, it'd be uh, delegating EOS to a new account if you leave it unclicked. Okay, that means that the stake belongs to the creator and that the creator could take it back. If you don't want to be able to take it back and you just want to give it to this new account, you put yes, stake belongs to new account. And then the, the EOS that you put here, the amount of EOS that you enter here will belong to the new account. Of course, this EOS is going to come out of your account, the creator account. Okay, guys. Uh, so let's talk about name auctions. 
name auctions. If you click over here, name auctions, the premium names, you'll see that the premium names are now being bid on. Okay. So some premium names like the number one, the name Binance, CPDAX, Black, Coin Bank, and other names are currently being bid on. So I was like, well, you know, how do I, how do I secure a premium name out here? How do I secure a name like a uh, champagne, for instance? Uh, well, the way it works, guys, is that you need to bid on it, okay? So you just don't buy it, okay? So you're, at, some may be asking, who are you going to be buying it from? So basically, you're buying it from the EOS blockchain itself, okay? Uh, the way it works, uh, and it took me a while to figure this out, but shout out again to Generios uh, for providing such useful tools and information here on Steam. Uh, I'll have this link down below, this actual article, Name Bidding and Premium Names on EOS. And... Uh, I have it highlighted. So it turns out that to get a premium name, only one name will be awarded each day. The name awarded is the one that has the highest bid of all names as of that day. So going back here to the toolkit, you could see that the number one here, the name number one has the highest bid out of all the names with 33 EOS. So assuming that things stay the same, this, uh, name number one will be awarded to this bidder gyyt etc okay and so on so uh, according to this information only one name will be awarded each day so if that's true there's only 365 premium names awarded on the eos blockchain yearly okay so you got a bid on it so right now the hottest name is number one okay and then binance and that's understandable binance being uh one of the largest uh exchanges with volume out there with crypto uh, trading volume okay uh so yeah that's that's what it is i hope i'm explaining everything correctly uh and again shout out to jenner eos uh block producer candidates out there they have definitely earned my vote uh for creating this uh toolkit i think it's a, a pretty kabooming uh you can also check out the new eos eos toolkit it's a better interface uh basically created by the same uh group jenner eos and uh, they created a new interface here at eostoolkit.io, okay? And it, it looks a little bit more uh, spruced up, okay? Uh, you know, where you could see the governance, the uh, constitution. You can search for accounts, and then you can create a new account. The same way, uh, the same way as the other site. It's just, uh, uh, just another interface here. So let's say, you know, you want to create a new account where account name one. That would work, you see? But if it's just account name, it wouldn't work. So if you wanted a premium name like, you know, uh, you know, champagne again, that wouldn't work either. So if I want the name champagne, I'm going to have to put a bid on the name champagne. And to win that name, I have to be the highest bidder on that uh, out of all names uh, for that day. So, I mean, it's going to take some time. I mean, it's going to be some time. There's only 365 names awarded on the EOS blockchain, premium names awarded on the EOS blockchain, according to uh, this information posted here by Jenner EOS or Generous. Uh, big shout out to them again. I'll have everything linked down below. Uh, also, I invite you guys to check out EOS Flare. This is another blockchain explorer. It shows you the top voters for blockchain candidates. It also shows you the top name bids. So it turns out the actually top name bid is uh, the name EOS. I'm not sure why it's not showing up here on the generous eos toolkit but the number one does show up as the bid for 33.3 okay so it looks like uh this name may be awarded if i'm not mistaken i don't know if the name eos will be awarded i think that they're uh that, that's like super premium uh so it looks like the actual one that will be awarded today will be number one and then uh de depending on how much people vote you can see binance just fell down in the rankings too to a number seven let's see if it's reflected here on this website Going back to uh, tools.generius.com slash names. You can see, uh, let me hit refresh. So it looks like, you know, they, they don't update exactly at the same time. Because Binance is number three here and uh, EOS Flare has Binance ranked as number seven. So let's see if the bid amount is the same. The bid amount is the same. It looks like EOS Flare may be, uh, be updating uh, faster than uh, EOS Toolkit. The generous, uh, generous Toolkit. 
anyhow, um, I hope that that explains things for you. So just to recap here, you can create a name, okay, uh, using an existing account. And uh, you could do so by going to this toolkit, okay, here, clicking tools and create an account. Uh, assuming that you already paired your scatter, okay, you got to pair your scatter. Scatter, again, is a Chrome extension that uh, secures your private keys and allows you to log into an EOS portal. In this case, it would be this toolkit. And uh, you got to go ahead and create the account name. The account name must be 12 characters using A through Z and 1 through 5 only. If it doesn't meet that specific criteria, it's considered a premium name. And in that case, you need to bid on it. Okay, and uh, with premium names, we've already identified here that only one name will be awarded each day. The name awarded is the one that has the highest bid of all the names of that day. Okay, guys, some may be asking, so where's this money going to? Okay, and that's a great question. You could see that someone asked that, and uh, Dan Larimer himself commented here on this thread. He says the proceeds go to a dedicated EOSIO.names fund to be allocated or burned by the community later, okay? And uh, that's what it is. So, you know, very interesting. We're learning as we go here, crypto maniacs. And again, uh, don't take me as a crypto professional. Uh, I may be wrong on some of the information that I'm providing here. I'm just learning here in real time, sharing it and asking uh, more, more asking questions than actually making statements out here. Uh, trying to ask the right ones and identify uh, what may be the boomers and removing the doomers out there, guys. Uh, providing uh, the information that I found here. Uh, you know, it looks like Generios toolkit is pretty sexy. And again, they've earned my vote for block producer candidates. So I'll be voting for them uh, using the um, EOS, the gray mass wallet. I, I, I like the, the desktop app. Uh, I'm not particularly that fond of uh, Chrome extensions, but it seems like uh, most sites require uh, scatter. But, you know, you don't need to use scatter to vote. You could do it with the gray mass wallet. And uh, I'm sure the gray mass wallet uh, will probably uh, create a uh, feature to uh, make new accounts uh, as well soon. I, I'm, I'm assuming that, uh, but not yet. OK, so right now, uh, this is the only way that I know how to create uh, account names, 12 characters using A through Z and one through five only. Uh, again, you need to generate a pair of private and uh, public and private keys on scatter there's other uh, websites that allow you to generate keys but you know let's keep it safe and do it there on scatter uh, get the public key that you generated enter it here on the owner key tab and the active key tab you want to enter the same public key here okay and then uh put in the amount of uh, eos you'd like to stake on the net and the cpu okay and kaboom that's it that's that simple it's just a uh, create contract and there it goes and then uh, once you um created the account name you can come back here and search for that account name that you just created and it should pop up uh, right here it should give you that information and show you the amount that was staked in the wallet that you chose uh, drop a comment below drop questions below let me know if you know of other uh methods to create accounts if uh, i missed any points here but uh you know if you want a premium name there's only 365 names that will be issued this year on the eos blockchain and they will be going to the highest bidder according to the information here on the generous eos or Jenner. i'm not sure if i'm pronouncing that uh, right guys but you guys get the point Jenner eos uh steam it post and um according to that information it's just a uh, one per day okay guys uh drop a comment below let me know what's shaking and baking it's the voice of the blockchain here satoshi's big cousin cryptography's finest champagne crypto thanks for tuning in